So it's a boiling, blistering hot day in Florida, but it could be worse. So I got the girls out today, let them get a little suntan action. Actually, I'm cleaning out the barn. Uh, we have some youth kids coming from the church this weekend. And as you've probably noticed, there's a foosball, ping pong table, a couple other things out there. So uh, the wife has requested that I get the barn cleaned up so the kids can use it this weekend. So anyway, while I'm cleaning the barn up, I give the girls a little suntan. But made a few changes, a little upgrades over the last day or two. So when I got the car, it had an oil cooler that was mounted way up at the top of the radiator and it was really not good <laughs> the way the installation was done. It was uh, used a big piece of flat bar and it was kind of ugly. So uh, I've reconfigured all that and I've actually mounted the oil cooler down on the uh, splash pan below and uh, it looks real good. It's out of sight, out of mind. Uh, it'll still get plenty of airflow for the amount of time that this car will get driven on the street for any long distances. So once again, I got the, got my fire core wires installed and I moved the uh, coil. The coil had been mounted over here on the fender well and I moved it over on top of the intake manifold which is normally where they're supposed to be at on a cross ram application. So I just kind of trying to put things back where it's more stock and original looking. Um, I know it's a race car hot rod, but I also like a real original look. So try to decide what to do with all that fuel line plumbing. Uh, these cars really don't need that big of fuel line plumbing. They're fine with a 3 8 inch, just a normal cross ram uh, plumbing for the carburetors, fuel line. So I'm thinking I'm gonna buy a kit from a and and just put the stock uh, fuel line system on it. Plus I'm really not crazy about the purple, the blue, the red, yeah. Anyway, so, uh, that's kind of it. Just making a few little changes on it there. Uh, got the, the uh, front engine, front headlight wiring harness all put back up with some nice new clips. Just freshening up a few things that I uh, wanted wanted to change. But uh, yeah, that's what's going on on a uh, steamy Wednesday here in Florida. So. And stay tuned for the next video. I got a kind of a cool little deal we're going to do on an appearance thing for the car. So I uh, don't want to reveal that quite yet, but you'll see next video. So say goodbye to the girls while they're suntanning. <laughs>